Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope everyone's having a fantastic day. Um, today's video is going to be about some of the things that I've purchased for my holiday. Um, so it's a little bit different to what I normally do, but in saying that, um, it is also things that I've bought when they've been on special or they're very cheap items that I've purchased. So nothing that's going to break the bank. So if you're looking for some of these items um, when you're traveling, then I'm going to make sure I'm going to link everything below that I can find and hopefully I can find everything that I've bought. Some of these things I've been buying since um, like the middle of last year. So just little bits and pieces here and there. Um, so this, these things that I've got here are all just little bits and pieces that I've bought. Um, I've bought a luggage scale. Uh, my daughter actually works at, has worked at the airport and he's now a flight attendant. Um, so we were quite well aware of, you know, the costs for having excess baggage, etc. Um, I bought this scale a while ago and I can't remember how much I actually paid for it. I think I bought it from either Big W or maybe Kmart, I'm not sure. Um, I'll definitely have a look and see if I can find the link for it. Um, but you just hang on to the handle and you put your bag on here. Um, my daughter was quite sceptical about whether these actually work or not. Um, but when she went away for her training, we weighed her bags with this and then she weighed them again when we got to the airport. So um, it was completely accurate. So I'm really happy with that. So um we've got included luggage and we've got we should not have any issues we've got um a lot of um a lot of weight that we can take with us and I'm, I'm not too stressed but i just wanted to to have that on hand just so that we can um make sure that we are not you know over with our luggage it does say that it includes a measuring tape ah oh, also has a measuring tape if you are looking for a, the size of your bag as well, if you're concerned about that. Mine was just more the weight of it that I was concerned about. Um, I bought this little container off Shan, um, just that put cotton tips in or you could put band-aids or just anything little that you don't want rolling around. I hate when you have cotton tips, if they're just loose in one of your bags, they end up with dust or you know makeup or something on them. So I've bought that to put to put in there. These little containers were also off Sheen. They were very, very cheap, you know, a couple of dollars. And I bought them just to put um, like rings or jewelry in um, that you can have in your pocket um, or your bag. I've got, um, my girls have all got like little miniature travel jewelry cases. So if they're taking them off and storing them, but if you ha they have to take them off to go to the pool or anything like that, they can put them in these and put them in their, in their bags. Um, these were from Kmart. They were a pack of four, but we actually used two of them when we went camping um, just to put your toothbrush in. And then it also will stick to the wall um, in the bathroom if you want to um, do that. But it just keeps them nice and clean in your toiletry bag. Um, now, I bought two little, um, like, medical kits they're empty they were these were off sheen and they were like two dollars each or something they were very very little this one i bought um it's a small one just to put a few bits and pieces in to put in one of our handbags um or backpacks while we're actually going to theme parks or traveling around so something that's a bit more um we can take with us um, this one is a little bit bigger um, the same thing, I thought this was going to be slightly bigger than it than it is, um, but it's actually probably bigger, as big as it needs to be. And I thought this one might we might leave in the car, and that'll just have a few more things in it um, if we need to, to have that in the actual car with us. The same thing, these were off Shan. Um, we all got one of these for Christmas. Um, Santa bought all of these for us. I think they were a couple of dollars. <laughs> And um, it was three different colours and it was just all random and we chose, I bought six and we all got navy. So hopefully we don't get any of those confused. And it's just got a little pocket inside. I don't know if you can see that, a mesh pocket with a zip. And also um, some elastic there if you want to 
tight. So I bought this for everyone to put their electrical cords, like their chargers and, and everything in to keep those all safe and secure. So we've all got those. I've already used this one when I went camping um, and it fits um, everything that I need in that perfectly. Okay, um, so when it comes to a lot of toiletries, um, I've been saving up through the year. Um, my sunscreens, I actually bought two of these and a cream one. Um, but my son's got one of them in his work bag and my daughter has one of them for her work as well. Um, so that should hopefully be plenty for us to take away. But when these were half price before Christmas, I used my Everyday Rewards dollars to get those. Um, so technically I didn't actually pay for them, but I did buy them um, when they were half price. So it's a good idea when you're going away to stock up on, you know, these toiletry items when they are on special, like keep an eye out before you go. Um, my toothpaste, same thing. I got that when it was half price and the same thing with my shampoo and conditioner. Um, we used to all use this shampoo and conditioner. Uh, now my daughter is a um, hairdressing apprentice. We don't um, use this as much. My son just uses whatever we have in the shower, <laughs> um, whatever we have. Um, but my uh, my two daughters and myself, actually my three daughters and myself, all have um, really nice salon um, shampoo and conditioner. But instead of us um, taking the smaller bottles and stuff, I've just and I bought this before we got got our nicer shampoo. Um, but I got these when they were half price, so we'll be taking these to use just so we don't have to all have different because we've um, the the shampoos and conditioners we've got are all slightly different um, due to our hair. So we've just made the decision that we're going to take these instead of taking lots of different um, different shampoos and conditioners just for this particular trip. Um, and I got a travel size hairspray. We don't use a lot of hairspray, but um, I just have a huge big one in my bathroom and we didn't want to have to take that. So I thought I'll just get a small travel size one. Um, I got that the other day. So we've got that and... Um, yeah, we don't need, don't have to take a huge one. So it just makes a big difference when, you, you know, when you're, you know, you've got a trip coming up just to try and buy these things in advance because I would have saved, um, 30 to $40 on buying these when they were half price. Um, like buying, you know, all my toiletries that I bought for, for half price, it's made an absolute, you know, real big difference. So um, it's definitely something to keep an eye out for. Uh, now these items are a little bit fluffy because my cat was just laying on them. Um, I bought actually bought these hats this morning. I do own a couple of them, but when we moved, I cannot for the life of me find them. Um, and they are only $6 each. So I decided to get myself a grey one and a black one. And for anybody else that has ponytails, will appreciate the whole for your ponytail to go through. They're the best, the best hats. Um, I have the, I have it in black, grey and white and cannot find the three of them. So I've now purchased it in grey and a black one, which must have fallen out of the bag in the car because I cannot seem to find that one. So I think it might be my daughter's car. Um, but yeah, so they were $6 from Kmart. Um, they don't have them all the time, but yeah, if you have a ponytail and you like to wear a cap, I recommend going and getting these. They are brilliant. I think they also come in pink as well, but I'm not really a pink person. So I just got the grey and black. Um, now, I found, I've been looking for these for a while, and I spotted these that came out the other day. Um, they are a swimmer bag. See at the top there? So it's a large swimmer bag. It is $8, and it has got a handle. Um, and so I'll just show you the other one. I've already undone this one. They are lined inside, so they are waterproof. So you can put your um, bathers in them, and... Um, you know, if you need to put them back in your suitcase. So we're actually staying at two different hotels while we're away. Um, we're going to Brisbane and the Gold Coast. So we will actually, you know, potentially be swimming and um, on the day that we are leaving. So we'll be able to put our wet stuff into some nice bags. I only got two. I thought we can fit everyone's in, in the two bags. And they, these ones are $8. And they're from Kmart as well. Um, and they had a couple of um, other patterns as well. But these are the ones that I got. Um, yeah, so I'm really looking forward to, to trying these out as well. Okay, so now some happy mail. Um, this was a click and collect order that I actually did the other day. 
that they haven't opened yet. You can have a chance to open this. Uh, just a few more things that I purchased for while we are away. Okay, so I got um, two packs of these um, carabiner clips. They're great for um, putting your, like attaching things to your bag or um, they, there's so many purposes. We use them all the time um, and I just needed to get a few new ones. So we've got, these ones are $2, I think they were $2.25 maybe each. Um, so I got two packs of those and then I got um, two packs of band-aids. Um, I still have to get blister band-aids, which I haven't got yet, um, but these are really good ones. I got some really um, tough ones if we have any big issues and then a pack of the small uh, 40 pack of the um, next sort of um, ones down. They're still tough and they're still really good, really good quality ones. Um, I'm not exactly sure, but I'll link those down below so you can see how much. Um, Kmart's a really good place to buy these from. They're really good price. Okay, and my last Happy Mail is from Amazon. Um, now, I wasn't sure if this was actually going to be here in time. Um, it was a bit of a late, last minute um, one. I'm so glad it's arrived. It actually arrived today and... Um, it wasn't supposed to arrive until the day we were leaving. I wasn't too concerned because if it didn't actually arrive, it's still items we would have used um, later on. But we definitely wanted them for a while while we were away. Okay, so these are little fans. I can have a few on. Oh, they're actually rechargeable. And... Yeah, so they fold up nice and flat. And then when you finish with it, oh, they open up. And then they just fold down and they just fit in your purse. They're great. Um, I've got a couple of uh, recharger ones that's much bigger, but it doesn't really fit in your bag very well. So I definitely wanted to get um, some smaller ones. Okay, so I might move these fans. So we've got four fans. Uh, my son says he doesn't want one, so... Be taking note of that when we're all using ours and he is dying of the heat. <laughs> um, now, this drink bottle, I haven't used one of these before, but um, a YouTuber that I follow, she recommends, she has one and she recommends them. So I thought, oh, I might give it a go. Um, I We drink a lot of water and I hate not being able to have a drink, and I but I also don't want to have to carry... Um, carry a drink bottle all the time as well so um like you know a full a full drink bottle so um i've been told that there are some places around where we're going that we'll be able to fill up our drink bottles and so it actually unfolds and it's like a larger drink bottle and then when you finish with it it just clips onto your bag so i'm really excited to um, give that a go and um, like i said these ones are from amazon and I'll link these below. Um, we'll give it a bit of a test out and see how it goes. And then I'll um, link it below if I'm happy with that. It looks really good. It feels very good quality. Um, and the last item I've got uh, that I've purchased for this trip is... Um, so I've got one of these that I bought off eBay, which was a really, really cheap and nasty one. Um... So, and it's, it makes such a big difference having all my information everywhere um, where I need it. And so I decided this, I had a, um, like a discount code for Amazon. So I got um, everything a little bit cheaper and I had a little bit of extra left over. Um, so I thought I'm going to splash out and get myself a nice one. And you can just put your travel tickets in it and your itinerary and, and just di different bits and pieces that you need for traveling and um, like I said, I got a really cheap one from eBay and we, we loved it and we used it. But when I moved, same thing, it's probably in the same box somewhere with my hats, but <laughs> I haven't been able to find that yet. So this is such a pretty design. Um, it wasn't much cheaper than, and it's like, actually, it's a really good quality one. 
Um, it wasn't really much dearer than the really cheap and nasty ones. So I thought, no, I'm going to get a really pretty one and have everything stored where, where it, like it's all together. So um, the same thing, I'll link that below. Now, these last two items that I've got are not actually things that I've purchased. I actually got these for Christmas. Um, this is a really great um, like little purse to put in your pocket. It's actually um, from Francesca. I think these are about $40. I got this for free for Christmas. Um, I bought um, quite a few Francesca pairs of earrings for Christmas for Christmas presents. And I got this for free. So it's got a section that you can put your notes in. And it's got a couple of spots for cards. So then that's great. And you can just slip that into your pocket. And if you need to have that, oh, it's got actually one cards on the back as well. So if you just need to take it, but you don't need to take, you know, heaps of things, then this is a really great option. So I'll be taking that with us. And also these are fantastic. I bought my kids ones um, for Christmas last year. These are from Typo. Um, but my daughter bought me, because I didn't get myself one, which I regretted every time we go camping. Um, and you're laying in bed or, you know, you want to prop it up and watch your phone then you can stand your phone up and just prop it up like that. So the ones that I bought for my kids do not have a charging hole. And that's really frustrating. So I love mine. It's got a hole and you can charge your phone while you are watching it. And this one also goes sideways and you can put your phone this way or this way. So that's really, really good. So I'll definitely be packing packing that one as well. Um, but if I still have these, I'll link these on um uh, down below as well but i'm not sure if they still still have these or not because they tend to have um periods where they have them and then they don't have them have them anymore okay so thank you for watching my video um i just thought i would do a few little videos on things that i've purchased that are um, low cost and you know don't break the bank but you can get a few little bits and pieces that make traveling a bit easier the fans are really important. We live um, in Tasmania and it is nowhere near as warm as it is on the Gold Coast. So it's going to be a bit of a shock for us. The weather's been pretty warm here lately, um, but yeah, nowhere near as warm as it's going to be up there. So yeah, we definitely wanted to, to get little fans to take with us. So, um, but yeah, um, I'll list everything below. Um, like I said, Pretty much everything that I purchased, I really didn't pay full price for anything. Um, everything was discounted when I purchased it, and it it definitely pays to look around and you know, with Amazon, not so much with my Amazon, but with my Shein, I tend to go and find things that I like, and I put it in my cart, and I wait until there is a discount code that you know suits me and I'm happy with, and then I check out. Um, with my toiletries, I waited till things were on special. I just made myself a, a list in my apps. And when they're on special, that's when I purchase them. And it just makes such a big difference and you can save so much money by, by doing that. So um, this will be the first video in my travel series. And as we go on, I'll show you some of my packing um, and stuff in my envelopes, how I'm budgeting while I'm away and how I'm actually what I'm having in cash, how I'm storing it, what I'm doing. And yeah, so you'll see some um, some vlogs while we're away as well. And, um, a, you know, a wrap up when I get back on how much I spent and, you know, my tips and tricks and things we could have done better or what I was happy with. And um, just a bit of a wrap up when we get back and, um, you know, let you know everything that we, we did and any, you know, sort of savings um, things we found along the way. So I hope everyone's having a fantastic day. Thank you for watching my video. If you could sub subscribe to my channel and give this video a like, I would very much appreciate that. And if you can leave me a suitcase emoji in the comments below to let me know that you've watched till the end of the video. Okay, thanks very much for watching. Bye.